Hi Scorpio, it's Elle here to do your oracle reading for this week. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this Scorpio. Thank you Lord God for blessing the Scorpio Collective with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Scorpio, how you, especially if you're a male, Scorpio, how you're coming into the connection is official person, okay, and then main female, okay. And if you are a female, Scorpio, um, you're dealing with um, maybe a man that holds an official title, um, it could be your husband, is your husband, um, someone official in your life. You also could work together, you do something together, okay? Um, there's a decision that needs to be made here, Scorpio. Um, it could be surrounding um, single life. Some of you just can't let the single life go, man or, or woman. Um, some of you just talk to hear yourself talking. You like hearing yourself talk. You know, some of you, again, you can't let the single life go because this is, you know, this is an eight party relationship. I'm open to everybody. You know, we, we talk about third party, but this person says eight, you know, this, they are open to everyone. And the eight, and the eighth house is ruled by Scorpio, I believe. Um, somebody needs to make a decision a decision is up in the air there's a secret person here um there's somebody who doesn't have the the title as girlfriend fiance wife okay there's somebody in the background the background the uh, the something else also could just be the fact that scorpio has a, a woman okay but they also like the single line so those are the two things that they kind of, you know, shift back and forth from being back, you know, they go to their person and then they go back to the single life and they just go in between. There's somebody who's just not ready to let it go. Okay. Because maybe they have a lot of prestige in the world. Um, their name, you know, rings bells to people. They could be wealthy. Um, they have cr created some type of empire dynasty for themselves uh, in their own community. People know them. There's somebody who's just not ready to let it go. Okay. But they do have somebody that they are dealing with, um, you know, one-on-one, -on -one, but then there's other people. Okay. Um, your person is coming to the reading Scorpio is match made in heaven. So they just feel like this is just absolutely where they want to be, who they want to be with. This person could live far from you or they do something for work where they have to travel in a car or on something on land. They travel in land in a car, a motorcycle, something that has wheels, okay? Bike. Um, they're, they're out and about, they're in and out. Um, they also could just live far from you. They, get, they could travel to you also heard of like driving past your house too they do something with where their occupation involves traveling around so maybe they're following you or they have a tail on you or they i don't know they definitely um can they have access to you this also could be like real estate too um this person could work with you okay um, your person feels like it's a match made in heaven, but somebody's not taken to it or the relationship needs to transition. It needs to, you guys need to go down a new path. It can't be like the, the same, the old, um, it seems as if you guys are stuck in some cycle here, uh, where you're off and then you're on and you're off and you're on somebody feels like they put too much energy into this connection and they're not getting what they actually deserve or they want out of the connection 
there's also an energy of where, I don't know, it could be you, Scorpio, or the other person who's saying, look, I'm trying to get more money for us. So I don't have a lot of time. Ugh, somebody is just, ooh, dirty. Take a shower. Addicted to sex with anybody. And then we have eight party relationship coming up. Somebody's out in strip clubs. They're out doing their thing. They're, they're, they're in the world. And, you know, this is a person who says remorse. What is that? Huh? They don't have any of that. So if you're looking for that, it, it doesn't exist. Um, again, this person manipulates you. They say what um, they think you need to hear in order for you to stay. Um, they love spending time together with you, you know, because they, I guess they get to have sex. But then there's an the energy of someone saying, I can't wait for you to change. I'm leaving. Yeah, there's an the energy of someone saying, I, I got to go down a new path. Either the relationship transitions or I transition. I get the hell out of here. Um, the universe and this person wants you to know that you have complete control in this situation. You know, just leave. Um, and there is someone here who understands that they can't give you what you deserve. OK, um, even though you feel like even though maybe the other party feels like there's a match made in heaven and it could be vice versa. This could be you, Scorpio, dealing with somebody who is just all over the place the overall energy is self-employment so find a way to work for yourself this has been coming up for you guys a lot some of you are already self-employed self-employment if you're already self-employed it's going to get better put more work into it. it definitely will get better if you are not and you're thinking about it this is just indication that go for it you can do it um, it's going to be hard work, but it could lead, you know, lead you to being the wealthy man, wealthy woman. Um, yeah, this is this is what the cards are saying. There's somebody who just can't let the single life go. They're out in the streets. They may act, put on this front or this act as if you are the only one, or this is, you know, you're the only one that they want to be with, and maybe they do. They still, there's somebody addicted to sex here. You know, there's somebody who just, they need help you can't give them. And they know that um, they can't give you what you deserve because they need their own help. They need to gain clarity. You, some of you could be seeing 222. Two, two. Also, um, a decision needs to be made. It's up in the air. And, and both of you know this. Um, somebody's highly sexual. Uh, someone likes same sex also. I feel like it's a woman, uh, or at least she's open to it or she's sexually fluid. Um, this is your reading. I hope that it resonates for you, Scorpio. If it does, go over to the website, book your own reading. They, oh, we got to get an outcome. What's the outcome of this relationship? Outcome this one sentimental feelings yeah um the sentiment is there the is the the residual the leftover feelings they're still there um there's an inkling sometimes of wanting to do right or go backwards or but somebody just can't it's failure to pull the ch trigger um you may have to leave this situation alone altogether um, deal with the sentimental feelings uh, with time this will pass grieve heal but move on wow as I say that this came out of my hand Gr grief work I think you guys had something like that yesterday like fabulous doing well but needing to grieve yeah grieve the fact that this is just not gonna work okay um, not now it doesn't mean not ever, but not now. Um, this is what I have for you. Go over to the website book there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text a question to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link. Thank you, Scorpio. Many blessings to you. Take care.